Now, why Portland for you? So it's a new challenge for me, a new chapter in my uh, career, uh, and I want to win something. I think uh, back in England, the chances to win something is uh, very little, and uh, for me to come out here, the opportunity to be at Portland Timbers was uh, something I'm going to relish and look forward to the opportunity. When Help. did you arrive? I've been here for uh, over a week now, and uh, I'm loving it. The lads have been fantastic with me. Um, so I just want to get started. I want to get out there and get playing. How big of a, obviously Liam coming here, how big of an influence and how much did you talk to Liam about this decision? Yeah, obviously I had a good chat with him. Um, had a good uh, phone call with uh, Caleb and for me that was enough. You know, knowing I'm going to come out here and potentially play at the back with uh, Liam. I played with uh, England youth level with him. I know all about him when he was at Aston Villa, Birmingham. Played against him in the Premiership. So uh, yeah, it was exciting for myself to come out here and a fellow Englishman as well makes my life easier. And uh, but the guys here, you know, they've been making me feel very at home. Do you so, think that will help the transition at all? Just that you and Liam have a similar background and similar. It definitely helps. Um, so hopefully, uh, time will tell on the pitch. And for me now, uh, it's build up the relationship and training, and uh, with the rest of the guys, and um, yeah, get used to this the team system and the different styles of play that Caleb is doing. Sounds like you can get thrown right into the mix. I was away for the opportunity. My main thing now is uh, getting fit and really be called upon, but uh, I'm excited and I just can't wait to get out there now. It's just uh, yeah, itching. How close to full fitness do you think you are right now? That's up to the, uh, the fitness guys and I'm going to keep grafting every day and uh, hopefully um, next few weeks will be out there. How much is the fact that the MLS is just in the last couple of years, you know, growing in the, in the different players, how much is the MLS's improvement? Uh, how much did that go into your decision? I think if you look at the quality now that MLS is uh, bringing across and the players that are over here now, we've got some world-class players and the MLS is getting better each year. And for me now to be a part of that in this project, the Portland Timbers, is something uh, you know that I'm looking really forward to and, uh, and being part of. How did the conversations first start with the, the when the Timbers contacted you and how um, the process kind of went along for you? Uh, Caleb basically sold it to me with, you know, just won it and uh, want to win trophies and um, I want that ring. The championship ring is my, my main goal for coming here and he said you won't get that kind of chance back in England and it's a new chapter for me to play and um, just get that excitement feel, new lease of life for me out here now and uh, it's like a feeling when I left school at 16 to go and play professional football for my hometown club in Newcastle. I've got that feel now where it's uh, the excitement's back and for me now I've, I've got my happy feet. What did Liam, what type of thing did Liam say when you talk about the league and what to expect in terms of the game and the way it's played? Yeah, obviously you mentioned it is tough. The players obviously are going to play against the best uh, strikers in the MLS because their teams here, they do buy the best. So it's going to be a test for me uh, every week, which I understand. And uh, he said it's just getting better and better out here. The, uh, the players, the quality, I think uh, it would surprise you if you do come across. And when I came across and seen the uh, training facility, the stadium, uh, met the boys and trained with them. Uh, I understand now why why I came here. And, you know, for me, it's it's a great chance and a great opportunity to, to come here. And uh, like I said before, let's just win some stuff. What did Liam say? Maybe as far as a big difference between MLS and the Premier League. Obviously, the heat. At some places, you know, you do a lot of travelling. Um, the heat in some of the places is going to be difficult. But you just got to uh, you got to adjust to it. And uh, like I said, there are players like you know, David Villa, the drug buzz of the world over here now, and. Uh, Perlos, uh, Bobby Keane, Gerard. There's some top, top class players. It's not like maybe 10 years ago, five years ago, you didn't have that here. Now it's a, it's a big, big chapter for myself to come across here, and uh, I'm relishing the opportunity. Have you watched any MLS before this opportunity came about? Yeah, you? absolutely. I watched because uh, Newcastle, we yeah, have obviously in Sky, Sky Sports over there. They uh, broadcast all the games, mm. so it's good. Obviously, after training, watching the uh, the MLS games and. Um, yeah, for me, I'm just glad to be here and I just want to get started and sooner rather than later because I'm sick of waiting. You got to see a game and I know you said you've seen the Timbers Army on TV, but to have it in, uh, to see it in person, uh, what was your impression? Yeah, I, I was just amazed. I think within the first 11 minutes we were 2-0 down and I looked to my left and the, uh, the Timbers fans, they never stopped and uh, they were very supportive and uh, very positive uh, towards the team and they're a great uh, Great set of fans, and everybody keeps telling me beforehand, you know, wait until you experience the Timbers, uh, Timbers Army. So for me to experience that was something good, and I want to be part of that and give them something to shout about. The Timbers have struggled a bit on defense this year. What do you think you can bring to kind of um, help solidify the back line, help the team improve in that area? Obviously, I'm going to come here to defend. I want clean sheets, and uh, I'm going to try my hardest to 
to give them something to shout about. And the uh, main thing for me is just winning games. I don't care how we do it, but as long as we win games, I'll be happy. How is your health and, and, and your feet? Very good. You know, I'm feeling good. Um, medical team here, yeah, the fitness team have been pushing me very hard. Um, day to day basis, just constantly on me. So I'm physically feeling good. I've uh, kept myself in shape all summer and uh, ready for this opportunity now. Hopefully it's going to come along in the next few weeks. I just want to get out with a plane and uh, get the, the green shirt on and win some games. I heard it's a multi-year deal. Can you tell us how long you signed for? Uh, no, I think obviously you have to speculate yourselves, but uh, for me, the main thing is I'm here. That's all you should be concerned about. And uh, let's, just, uh, let's just play and let's get some games in.